as hard a title shot to come by as there is in any UFC division is at 155 pounds. Here he is, the consensus number one lightweight title challenger, the number one contender, at least in terms of the rankings, getting set for a title fight here tonight. A lot of people think he is a live underdog in this championship setting. I guess we'll find out here, Joe Rogan. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. All right, here he is, the reigning defending undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Of course, the target is on his back. All eyes are on this man tonight as he tries to make good on yet another title defense. He has owned this division for some time. The question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25-minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. Our tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Two years apart, these two fighters with similar height and reach. We set it inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out O2 Arena in London, England, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of Manila, Philippines, presenting the challenger, Butcher. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Manila, Philippines, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC lightweight champion of the world, Express. Championship out. I want you guys to do a free fight. Follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Good luck tonight. Touch gloves. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, here we go. UFC lightweight title on the line.
Oh, oh my God. God! Beautiful technique, setting it up, and a beautiful job in getting that submission. Yeah, that is high-level stuff out of him there, Joe, to finish the submission. It's one thing to get the dominant position. It's another thing to close the show, and he certainly did that here tonight. That's a big one. And here's the end of the fight. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there he is, the UFC lightweight champion, and I'm not sure any 155-pounder could have held up under the onslaught here tonight. He wins the belt by way of submission. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is calling to stop to this contest at two minutes, eight seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by submission due to an arm bar. And the new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Butcher. Well, there is a new king of the 155 pounders, and you are looking at him, the undisputed lightweight champion. And it's one thing to come in and beat the champion. It's another thing to come in and submit him. So really an incredible result here tonight that we are still digesting, Joe. And as they celebrate in the corner, it's going to be very interesting to see who this fighter takes on next in the first defense of his 155-pound title.